So this is the Mashatu Hide. It's an underground hide and it offers a completely unique perspective to photographers. Usually wildlife photographers have the opportunity to photograph from game viewing vehicles, which doesn't have the most complementary angle for most wildlife species. Whereas at the hide here, when you're looking out, your lens is at the level of the elephant's toenails, and that's really something quite special. Hide is fully customised for photographers, and so everything is laid out inside so that you can keep your lenses um, and all your photo gear very easily accessible, so that you can switch between lenses and camera bodies very quickly and easily while the action is happening. We get a lot of different size herds coming through from small family groups of about five individuals to great numbers of herds of 30, 40 elephants all coming together and converging at the hive. You see the interactions between the different herds as they congregate around the water holes. So you can see the hierarchies established as the youngsters get pushed out of the way for older ones to get to the water and they actually have to stand in line, wait their turn, and if they don't, they'll actually get shoved and get back in line. The elephants tend to uh, make a bit of a mess here. They splash the photographers inside the hive uh, with mud. They do that just to coat their bodies in a protective layer. It helps for keeping them cool and keeping any biting insects, uh, parasites off their skin. We've seen quite a, a great variety of different species here. Baboons are common visitors, impala, kudu, steenbok, a few different species of mongooses, tree squirrels. It's really quite diverse. There are a lot of places in Africa where you can do uh, elephant back safaris, walking with elephants. Those are with, often with orphaned elephants, tame elephants, habituated to people. This is the only uh, scenario that I'm aware of in Africa where you actually have the opportunity to get within touching distance of wild elephants. And that's an entirely unique experience. <laughs> 